Good afternoon, y'all. It's your boy Sly. Sylvester Stevenson, but please call me Sly. Got to talk to y'all. Okay, during this spiritual journey, they tell you that when you begin to awake, friends that you thought were your friends are going to show their true selves because you can see them clear. You know, but you don't be looking for that in everybody. And that's something you got to change. You got to look for it in everybody. But I was talking with a group of friends the other day that I just knew was my group buddies from forever, right? So everything was cool. You know what I'm saying? I love these people now because, like, I love everybody. You know what I'm saying? It's in my nature to love people. But in the midst of this conversation, I see they begin to talk at me versus talk, we all talking together. So, I'm catching it, but not catching So I'm like, it's all us talking. But this one homeboy, he got real aggressive with it. And he was like, I'm trying to tell you, nigga. So I felt uncomfortable about it at the time. But after I processed what was going on and who was coming from, man, I really felt, as much as I love the dude, I felt some type of way for real. I'm talking about much as I love this friend, he always, I'm talking about he always been a Capadonna. I'm talking about Captain Crunch, all that. Cap, cap, cap. Love him to death, but cap, 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 cap. I love him, though. And this ain't me talking down on him. This just the nature of who he is. We accept him anyway. But when this person began to talk at me, it throw me, because this ain't even him. Mind you, this same person that had he had a call on the side of his mama house for twenty years, talk about what he was gonna do with it forever, and nothing happened. The tow had it became a, the car became a storage. Uh, talk about how he gonna rap, he gonna do this. Mind you, we hang with a dude that was making an effort to rap. He never made the effort to rap. He tell me, yeah, boy. Just the song on beat, just the beat I'm gonna use. This nigga ain't on now track. Them been every studio in America been in the villa to me. This nigga ain't never been. I ain't never seen him in the studio. Right? Same thing with the dogs, pit bulls. Yeah, boy, I'm gonna get me a game dog. I'm gonna do this. So a part of that deal with us, you know, that we all get our dogs from. I said, hey man, what's up with, with that dog he got, man? What's up? I, you know, I, I ain't know he had a dog because he always talk about getting them. It never happened, you know. But now he finally got one. Thank you, Jesus. Bless his heart. So I asked him about the dog. He said, yeah, man. He said, man, that boy got an aged dog. He just ain't going to never pull the trigger. Which goes back to everything this same person always said about him anyway. So initially, because this is my friend, I know him long. Now, I'm thinking you hating on him, but you he's not hating. He was telling me who this person was. But now that I see that this person is on the other side, and all the stuff I know about him. Somebody please get the devil on the hotline so I can renegotiate this nigga deal. Let me renegotiate the deal for him. Because, boy, he got pimp. Of all people, man, and I love him to death. People do what they do. But for you, for you to be into the witcher on the other side, nigga, you didn't get nothing. Nigga, they got damn, bro. And the more and more I find out about what's going on and who is who is, like, a lot of people I really feel bad for because, you know, I clearly see you made a deal. I clearly see you came in on the bad end of it. And for you to get anything, you have to disturb me. And it's not working. I feel bad, you know. Like, man, I love that dude and everybody. But it's a lot of people I see is like, it's so much better stuff. I ain't going to say you could. You need to do it your time to me because, well, look where I'm at right now. But they go to show, nigga, got to be special, cause boy. I'm talking about the click hop, the hung with. This person had to sack you, they best friend. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Whoa, whoa, had to sack. Whoa, had to sack, you were his best friend. Beanie had to sack, you were his best friend. You nigga go to jail, you find another nigga. Shit, Josh was that, Gant was that, you, you day friend. You over here with them now. You should be rich. You ain't never had to re-up now one time. You feel me? Hustling the next man bomb. And I love you, but when I seen this person coming at me like, bro, I got love you, but dang, bro, not you. Like, you didn't get nothing out the deal. Well, man, y'all play my breath. 
blessing of the Lord, Father Yahweh, it's just some things when when your eyes get open, like you're not gonna be able to handle it. It, it initially, like Nick, you too. Go rework that deal. Let me work the deal for you. Cause obviously you couldn't do it. Well, boy, it was sad, man. It was like it was sad, man. But man, y'all play my pray my strength in the Lord, man. Like, y'all stay prayed up out here, go boy. Every day is a new revelation. You're going to find out something new every day, and you got to be ready, man. But, hey, man, stay safe right here. Stay prayed up, man. Sports life.